So, let's talk about Tomb Raider, guys. Let's do my review of Tomb Raider. Overall, honestly, man, it just felt like, uh, like, um, I really wasn't, yeah, Cookie. I don't seem satisfied. I really wasn't satisfied. It, like, I honestly recommend the other Tomb Raiders a lot more. The story was very, like, really just super simple, um, very, like, copy-paste, vanilla, simplified Tomb Raider. Like, there weren't that many enemies to fight. Um, the climbing was almost confusing because... It's like they wanted to blend it in as much as they could with the environment. But it almost was like too blended in where you're you kinda like were like, I don't I'm not actually sure where I'm supposed to go. I can't really tell kind of a lot of time. Um There wasn't even that much there was there were not that many puzzles. The most of the puzzles were like the challenge tombs, which are like a bonus thing. And there's only a couple of those that I found. There's probably more that I didn't get to, uh, but... Yeah, there weren't many mobs to fight, um, not- just not a lot of fighting in general. There was a lot of underwater swimming, which was like... Okay, I get it. It just did not seem interesting. Ever, really. Um... Everything was just kind of average. Like, I mean, the ending, like, you know, was pretty little cinematic with music, but... Um, it was kind of just like a really boring version of Tomb Raider, to be honest. Um. Like, there was not a lot of shooting, there weren't any many puzzles, and there weren't that- there was not that many climbing, so. Um, a lot of the skills felt like- Like, the skills, like, there were some cool skills, but we didn't even bother unlocking some of the skills because- there just weren't that many people to fight. And I like that they try to do like a kind of open world D with the villages, but the the side quest felt um, really plain and like not really like even easy to find, to be honest. Not easy to, to like we barely did any. Because it just didn't feel like we needed to and it just kind of like, like it it wasn't like a good job of doing like the open worldness. Like I liked the idea of it, but it just wasn't done well. Um, I honestly, I recommend the, the previous two Tomb Raiders because they were so much fun. They're so much fun. They're action-packed, lots of fighting, lots of everything. There's still a lot of everything to do. Um, the, the story is actually, like, this story literally was like, from the beginning it was like, okay, we need to do this thing. And that's all you did through the story was you just, you, all you did was like, go and do the thing. It wasn't like, I feel like in other Tomb Raiders, where it's like, there's twists, there's different environments, like, things happen, things change, like, you uncover new things, it was kind of like, nothing changed. And it was just kind of like, really, just a really plain story. Um... I, I recommend the previous two games. I would pick this up maybe when it goes on sale. Um... It just didn't feel that satisfying. Like I was, I was just waiting for it to get better, and there was like a part towards like the last quarter of the game where it's like it was little, just like a, a taste of what the previous Tomb Raider games were like. And I was like, "This is this has me excited." And you guys know exactly what part I'm talking about. I was like, "This is Tomb Raider right here," and then that was the only part that felt like that. Um, man, I, I overall disappointed. I average, average. I would give it, like, 6 out of 10. Graphics are beautiful. Like, big points for graphics. Music is great. Voice actress for Laura Croft, amazing. Um, the characters were cool, you know, but... Everything else was just kind of, like... Like, it wasn't like the game was... Terrible. It just was like, yeah, it was just like, uh. How many hours did, did it take us? Uh, so we did, we got two thirds of the game complete. 
where we just ticked the 17 hour mark. But also, I spent a lot of time like talking and being very slow. But that's 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 like a slow. Um. So. The story length, I think, is okay. Like, the, like it's just... I mean, I don't even remember the previous two... What, what are the hours we have on the previous Tomb Raiders? Let me see. Uh, let's see. What are the other Tomb Raiders called? There's a... The... the I have a, So I have 11 hours in one of them. So yeah, the Tomb Raider games aren't that long in general. <sighs> Tomb Raider and Rise of the Tomb Raider, right? Maybe not. Or maybe I played it on PlayStation or something. I don't see it on here. It is Rise? Maybe it's on their Tomb Raider and it just... I don't know, I, I can't find it. But, um... So what are you saying? Skip this game and watch Grey's Anatomy instead for the Halora voice actress? Wait, what, what is she playing Grey's Anatomy? Um, so yeah, anyways, that's my review. It's just okay. It makes me just want to play the other ones because the other ones are so much fun.